What is Vaporwave? It initially emerged as an experimental music genre around the early 2010s by mixing the sounds of soothing elevator or spa ambience with electronic music. Since then, it has sprouted several sub-genres over the years and I suppose its influence is still apparent to this day with the likes of lo-fi music for instance. But music history aside, I shall be going over its prominent visual markers from an artistic and design point of view instead. Vaporwave is bright, poppy, and laden with vibrant neon color gradients. The art style pulls heavily from romanticizing the past, so prominent features may include ancient Roman Greek statues or architecture, juxtaposed with modern graphics ranging from dynamic grids and patterns borrowed from the Memphis art style, to Windows 95 user interfaces, irrelevant word art graphics, and random low poly 3D models. Other notable visual elements include Japanese pop culture references from early anime or manga illustrations, Nintendo games, and even the use of the language itself in order to evoke a sense of exoticism. Other visual contrasts that I have noticed include dreamy oceanic or landscape horizons as well as botanical visuals overlaid with the 80s or 90s technology that are garnished with glitchy, pixelated, or distorted effects also possibly serving as subtle connotations in celebrating consumerism satirically. In short, Vaporwave is a chaotic collage of nostalgic visuals that draws inspiration from the 90s but depicts the era in a futuristic setting. On a similar and retrospective note, I realized that I unknowingly drew inspiration from Vaporwave during one of my design projects back in my first term. It was a project aimed at creating concept marketing collaterals for an existing event. Looking back at it now, I can clearly see its stark influences all over the design, albeit in a structured manner. One would say that its influence came all the way from Japan's economic and technological boom in the 80s. This point in history led to the invention of devices that are frequently used as motifs in vaporwave artworks. The visual aesthetics of this style came about first as digital album cover art for music that they were made for, often seen in music videos. Since its music compositions are mostly remixes of sped down versions of old songs with modern beats, its visuals would naturally follow suit and play around with a collage of pop art and internet elements that millennials would feel nostalgic about. It is also very likely that its apparent bright visuals would also garner the attention of younger audiences. As a graphic designer, I feel a sense of unease seeing the lack of design principles in most of Vaporwave's artworks. However, I love seeing order out of chaos, and I think it's supposed to do just that. Vaporwave is a postmodern, ugly design audiovisual style that is made to turn heads, to explore what could have been, kind of like a form of ironic escapism to a bygone era of a dreaming future's past before its eventual escape to the internet. To be honest, I don't even know what that last phrase means, but it sounds aesthetic. <laughs> <laughs>